hello guys welcome to my channel today we are going to see how to fix the issue with valorant a critical error has acquired and the process must be terminated let's fix it guys you just need to click on this arrow icon over here right click on the right client and select exit after doing this right click on the start icon and select task manager in here if you are using any kind of tuner like msi after banner or revert tuner you just need to right click on it and select end task kit guys after doing this close it off here now you just need to right click on the start icon and select device manager expand the display adapter section right click on the graphics card driver and select update driver select search automatically for drivers the best driver for web device is already installed after updating it close it off here go to search menu and type services click on open it in services you just need to search for vgc service double click on it startup type set to automatic and if the service status is stopped you just need to start it select apply and ok for save changes now you just need to close stuff here now you just need to go to search menu and type cmd right click on the command prompt and select run as administrator and select yes now you just need to check my video description for this command used in my video you just need to copy it and paste it one by one after finishing all these commands you just need to close it off here and go ahead and restart your pc guys after restarting your pc check if the problem solved or not if not let's move on to the second solution guys you just need to go to search menu and type appwiz.cpl click on open it in here you just need to search for write vanguard right click on it and select uninstall it guys and select yes select yes again you just need to press in keyboard f5 to refresh this page as you can see we have deleted right vanguard now you just need to close it off here now open up valorant now select the update option over here after getting update done it requires you to restart your pc you just need to close it off here and go ahead and restart your pc guys after restarting your pc you just need to check if the problem solved or not i hope one of these solution fixed your problem guys if the video helped you don't forget to leave a like guys you can also subscribe me and support me guys thank you